rock star rabbi is coming to the Great White Way. Eric Anderson stars as Shlomo Karlbach in the new biomusical Soul Doctor. We're going to bring you a glimpse inside rehearsal and chat with the stars and creators. <laughs> about the soul doctor who is he why is his story stand out why is it special well, it's unique because uh, he was an orthodox rabbi who um, fell in with the with the 60s rock and roll world and and transformed him into uh, a hipster bard of universal love how did Nina Simone connect to the rock star rabbi so you've got a little black girl from the south who wanted to be a black classical pianist didn't quite work out the way she planned she ends up in this smoky piano bar playing for tips, not where she wanted, wants to be, but where she has to be to keep uh, food on the table. So you've got Shlomo and Nina who both have calls on their lives, who both have missions, who both have music that they know can heal the world, but their family is shunning them, telling them, you know, do what we tell you to do, you know, walk in the way of your people, of your family. And they both said, you know what, there's something greater. It's not the story of a uh, young musician who made it to fame and fortune. It's uh, quite the opposite. As someone who wanted to really help people, he had a burning desire to really heal people and to reinvigorate people. And he found music, which he had a this great, great talent for. He found music, and by discovering gospel and the black musical experience, he really created, fused his roots. Strength to carry on, join in my song of love and prayer. Clap your hands and beat on the drum. Let the music fill the air and let some comfort come. So, as an audience member, what what is my experience at the show going to be like? Am I going to be like wanting to get up and dance? Is it? Is it, things are happening all around me, tell me about it. Should I tell you all of it or tell should I give a just tease, a bit? A tease, yeah. Yes, you do. You will get up on your feet and dance. You will have the actors being, being all over where you will not expect. So it's really, really, really a visceral uh, experience for you guys to really understand who this man was and really feel it down to your bone and your core. It is so full of life. That's, that's, if I had to sum it up, I would say that the, um, the energy and the life in this piece is pretty, uh, pretty different. It's something I haven't, I haven't seen. His songs are songs that you, you feel like you know them almost instantly when you hear them because uh, they have that kind of organic quality of really connected to the heart of people. And I think that's the experience people will have when they see it as well. It's so diverse. It, 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 try, it runs from the Jewish roots all the way to the you know, amazing music of Nina Simone as well. And, and for them to, to, to mash like that is... is so unique. You've got what I like to call the crock pot of sound because you think you're Rabbi Shlomo, so we think we're going to be shuckling, and it's just no, you've got Nina, so you've got soul, you've got blues, you've got rock, you've got RB, you've got grit, you've got we have fiddles and guitars. Like it's the sound is going to kill you, first of all, but then you've got the uplifting story. You've got these two people on a journey of love, on a journey of purpose, on a, on a life journey. Um, it, it's it's for family, it's, it's for lovers of music, it's for lovers of a good story. It's just, we've got everything in this crock pot. You need to come taste it. That's what I'm telling people. <laughs> just come, bring a spoon, let's go. 